I'm going to play a game of solitaire for Mahjong competition rules. If you haven't downloaded the player reference yet, look for a link below the video. This player reference has the number of the original scoring element from the green book, but all these scoring elements are divided by category. Makes sense in my mind anyway. Download that document, let me know what you think about it, and let me know if it helps you identify potential score for your drawn hand. If you're new to Mahjong, or if you already know how to play and just want to build your skills, consider subscribing to my channel. That way, you won't miss anything. All my tiles are out. They have been mixed and built into walls next to the risers. This way we can keep track of the progress of the game based on how many tiles are left for picking. I'm going to deal the tiles now. East will get 14 tiles. Southwest and North will get 13 each. Then we're going to look at everybody's hand and see where we can find some score. You got to have eight points to qualify to win. So at least we could have a direction. I call that a waypoint. We're going to find waypoints. Everybody has their tiles. Let's see what we can do for East. Four, five, four, five. No, four, five. Pair, pair. Maybe we could play all simples. We would have five discards though. Maybe we could play half flush concealed. We'd have to throw away a pair of fives though. Let's start by discarding these. Although we could do five, six, seven, five, six, five, seven. Let's start by discarding the one and see what happens. Let's see what we can do for south. exchange that flower. All right, pair, pair, two pair. Other patterns. Hmm. Maybe we do have one, one, two, three. Let's start by discarding the eight dot and see what happens. Okay, let's see what we can do for West. Flower. Okay, pair of threes, pair of fours. If we can get a five bam, we could do mixed shifted pungs. That's number 42, eight points. Let's see what happens. We do have seven, six, seven, and seven. Let's start by discarding the one crack. Flower. One, two, three, two, three. No, one, two, three. Let's start by discarding these. Void a suit, unless we get one, two, three crack. Actually, maybe what we should do is get rid of the one and the honors and play all simples. Okay, let's see what happens. We're gonna discard. I think we said we we're gonna discard the one crack.
one crack. All right, all ready. They could chow, but I think if we were to play all pung, we don't want to chow. That would wreck that. I think we were thinking one, two, three, but we have no two, three in the bams or dots. I don't want to commit this early to that with those, those kind of gaps. Let's draw. Nine dot. Okay, well, one, one, eight, nine, two, three, southeast. Maybe what we ought to do is play outside hand where each block has a one, nine, or honor. We would have to throw away a chow and a pair. I don't think we should do that. I think we should maybe try to focus on one, two, three. We have to make a choice right now. Let's see if we can pair up. Hmm. Now there is something called a small straight. Let's see here, short straight, number 71, that's one point. One point, that's itty bitty. We have too many ones and nines to play all simples. Okay, let's see, these could bring score if we pair up. Hmm. We're closer to chows than we are pungs. Let's discard the east. Single honors are not going to do us any good. Maybe we could do something with no honors and pungs. All pungs, no honors. Maybe void a suit. Although we have a pair and a pair. All right, well, let's move on. We discarded. Nobody can take the east, so we're going to draw. Whew. Eight crack. Okay, I think we were thinking about maybe playing mixed shifted pungs if we can get a five bam or a two bam or discarding the ones and the honors. Let's discard this one dot and see what happens. One dot up here, one, two, three, oh, all simples. Let's draw. Six crack, they paired up. Right there, pair. Let's get rid of the honors. West. Nobody can take it. We're going to draw. Two crack. Okay. Let's get rid of these honors. North. Nobody can take it, so we'll draw. Nine crack. Discard the south. Drawing here. Green dragon. Okay, now they paired up a dragon. That's two points if we can pung it. We could maybe do all pung. All pung is six points. Dragon Pung is two. So let's start discarding what's out. Okay, the east is out, the one is out. The east and the one are out. We have mixed suits with two pair. Let's void a suit. Seven bam. 
voided suit is one point. Seven bam is discarded. Nobody can take it, so we'll draw. Seven dot. Let's discard the north and draw down here. North, that was just discarded. Drawing here. Two dot. All right, now uh, pair, pair. So we could do Hmm. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, nine. Let's get rid of the nine crack. There is some mixed triple chow potential. Nine crack, nobody can take, so we're gonna draw three crack. Void a suit, six bam. Nobody can take it. Oh, right here. We have to decide, do we want a Pung or do you mix triple ch chow? I think since we only have two pair, I would not take it. Let's draw. West. It's already out. Drawing for East. Five bam. Okay, <laughs> Pung. All right, well, let's get rid of the east. And we can draw here. Seven dot. Okay. Four, five, six, or two, three, four, seven, eight, nine, one, two, one, six, pair of sixes here. Hmm, let's see here. We need score. We have no honors, that's one. All chow is two, so that's three. Concealed is two, so that's five. We need three more points. We could void a suit, which means probably this one since it's what we have the least of. But if we hold this, we could maybe do a mixed triple chow. Let's shoot for a mixed triple chow and get rid of the one dot. I hope I don't regret that. Let's draw. Eight crack. Wow, look at this. Cracks. Let's get rid of the seven dot. We should play half flush and dragon pung. That's eight points. We could pung, 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 chow. One, two, three, four. All we need is a pair. Not here though. That would take away score mixing suits. I would sacrifice that. Seven dot. Nobody can take it. So we're going to draw. West. Wow. Okay. Drawing for east. Five crack. Let's get rid of this red dragon. Maybe we could get them to all simples. If we discard that nine dot, we've got all these fives. Four, five, four, five. We need a four crack maybe for a mixed triple chow. Okay, we're gonna draw. Nine dot. Okay, what were we thinking here? Chows. We have a pair here, seven, eight, nine, four, five, six, two, three, four, one, two, three, one, two, three, four, five, six, four, five, six, one, two, three, one, two, three. If we can get a two bam or a three bam, that would be really nice. Let's leave that and discard the nine dot. See if we can do mixed triple chow here and draw. Seven bam. We don't want any bams because we voided that suit. Let's draw. Four dot. Okay, maybe we can get them to all simples. 
Let's discard the green dragon. And we're going to Pung. Let's see. If it's that player there, it would look like that. Let's see. Because, no, no. There. This player discarded it. No, no, no. Let's see here. I'm all wonky. If I'm west, right here, and north discarded it, that's what it would look like. Oop. Put that in the wrong place. Okay, here we go. Let's get rid of this offsuit pair. Okay, we're gonna draw up here, three dot. We could have them play all simples. There's a seven, eight, three dot was discarded. We could do two, three, four, two, three, four. That's pure double chow. Here's a two, three, four pair. Get rid of the one for all simples. Let's chow. Right there, let's see. If I'm over there, it would be the player on my left. Let's see here, if I'm, oh. Two, three, four. Okay, we got a two, three, four up here. We're gonna get rid of the one bam. And we're gonna draw down here. We just got through the second wall, so we're now going into the middle game. Drawing for east, south. Drawing for south. One bam. Oof, one, two pair. That's not helpful. Four, five, six, one, two, three, potential. Seven, eight, nine, chow. One, two, three, potential. One, two, three, potential. Let's get rid of the one bam. See if we can get to one, two, three, mix triple chow. Nobody can take the one, so we'll draw. Nine crack, that's a keeper. All cracks, let's get rid of that three dot. Up here, we're gonna draw six bam. Okay, pair, isolated, two, three, four, isolated, or chow, 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 two, three, four, hopefully, seven, eight. Let's get rid of the eight crack. And we can draw down here. Here, though, we could potentially pung. One, two, three, potential pung, seven, eight, nine, isolated. Or we could pung and be waiting on a chow. Let's pung. So, Pung, Pung for West. East was discarded, let's throw that. And draw for North. Two dot, we have a pair. We need a two, three, four there. Two dot, nobody can take it, let's draw. Five dot, let's get rid of that nine dot. And they are concealed and they are in all simples. We have one, two, 
three, we have two pair and a pung. Let's see what happens there. If they get one more pair, we can pung and play all pung. If we can pair up this five, we could have triple pungs. Same pung in all three suits. Nine dot was discarded. Let's stay concealed here. South. Drawing for West. Nine crack. Let's discard that white dragon. Okay. We can maybe pung pung, discard that. This could be ready on a chow, maybe. Still one away. Eight crack we already got rid of. Eight crack down here. 8 bam. I think we should stick with what we have here. Nobody can take the 8 bam, so we'll draw. 6 dot. 4, 5, 6, 2, 3, 4, or 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 1, 6, 7, 8. Six, seven, eight. I don't think it really matters at this point. Let's throw the nine. It's already been out. Okay, here we go. Drawing seven, bam. Drawing up here. Two, bam. Two, bam. Pair of sixes. Two, three, four. These are kind of isolated, two, three, four. We have one, two, three, four out in dots. So that's one, two, three, four, and a pair. Let's get rid of this two bam. If we can get a four dot, they'll be ready to win on a six dot or, well, a six dot, because if we stick with all simples, they can get more score for that. Let's draw flower. Eight bam. Drawing for south. Nine bam. Not helpful. Drawing for west. Three crack. Okay, now let's see. Here, if we get rid of the seven crack, we can pung, pung, pung. Seven crack. Nobody can take it, so we'll draw. Three bam. Oh, we need a four dot. Two, three, four, that's set. Let's get rid of the three bam. Okay, drawing now down here. Three, four, five. Three, four, five, three, four, five. I think they're concealed right now, which is some score for being concealed. I don't think I will chow. I think they're closer to pungs. Let's draw. Five. Triple pung. Same pung in three suits. Let's see if we can make that work. Let's discard the two crack and draw here. They're con concealed still, flower. Seven dot. Okay, let's see what we got. Four, five, six, two, three. Chow potential, six, seven, eight, six, seven, eight. Pure double chow potential. Oh, this mixed triple chow is not really coming in. We could do all chow, no honors, pure double chow. All chow is two, no honors is one, so that's three. Pure double chow is one, so that's four. We need a lot more help than that. 
Maybe we should go ahead and get rid of the ones for all simples. Let's get rid of the one and give up on the mixed triple chow for one, two, three. One bam. Nobody can take it, so we'll draw flower. West. Drawing for north. Three bam again. Down here, one crack, all simples, triple pung. Triple pung is, pung is 16 points. Let's draw two crack. Oh, oh yeah, let's get rid of this one dot. So now they're all simples, pair, pair, pair. They might be able to switch to pungs, all simples and all pung. Let's draw four bam. Drawing for north, six dot. Okay, look at that, chow. Two, three, four, ready on a four dot. Four, all simples, pure double chow. All chow, no honors. Let's discard the six. So this is a side weight, ready on a four dot. Here we go. White dragon. Drawing four, south, five dot. Okay, let's see now. Four, five, six, two, three, six, seven, eight. Five, six, seven ish. Let's get rid of this two dot. Okay. Nobody can take it. We're going to draw eight bam. Drawing for north. White dragon. We'll draw for east. Red. Drawing four south, four dot. Okay, pair of sixes, four, five, six, or six, seven, eight. We have a pair here. We really don't need this pair here. The two, two, three, four. Let's get rid of the two. we had another pair in here, I might be tempted to play all Pung, but we only had three pair. I think they're better off with Chows. Let's draw. Okay, here. We could Chow and be ready on a double weight. Let's go ahead and Chow. I was hoping they could do Pungs, but this is going to take their score down a little bit, but a win is a good thing. Let's discard the three crack. So now they're ready on a four crack or a nine crack for half flesh dragon pung. We'll draw three crack. That's not helpful. And it was just thrown. Good safe discard. We're going to draw flower. Five bam. Let's Kong. That's a concealed Kong is to fawn. Two points. So we'll show it like so. The two in the middle are upside down to show that it was concealed. Concealed Kong. And we'll get a replacement. Nine crack. We want to discard that because we want all simples. Let's draw. Oh, that's Mahjong right here. Mahjong. Pair. Chow. 
pong. You know what? They also have all melded sets and they have two flowers. Okay, so let's see what their score is. I don't know if they would get melded hand because we were waiting on a double weight. So technically that was not exposed, but every one of these was made by a discard. So I'm not sure if that qualifies. That's six points. Melded hand. Four pungs or chows in a pair where each set is exposed. Number 53. I'll have to read about that. I think what this is, is half flesh dragon pung, two flowers. Half flesh, number 50 is six. Dragon pung is two, so that's eight. Two flowers is two, so that's 10. I believe that's all they get. I don't know if they get melded hand. I'll have to look into that. That's six points. Wait, melded hand. Hmm. Okay. I don't know. All right. So this player would, oh, let's see here. Oh, it was this one. This player pays the eight points plus the value of the hand. These two pay eight points each. For Mahjong competition rules, I've been told that you want to win as quickly as possible. So by them taking that chow as opposed to waiting for a pung, got them to a winning hand quicker. So I'm hoping that was the right thing to do. They're the only ones who get paid. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, consider subscribing. Click the little gray bell if you do. That way you'll get notification for when I post new videos and you won't miss an opportunity to learn a new strategy or pick up an insight to the game that could give you an advantage at the table. Between now and the next solitaire for Mahjong competition rules, may all your picks be keepers.